Here in Florida, if the locals reach for a topwater, you can bet it's a prop bait. Jimmy Liao from Fish Code Studios. Today, we're gonna look at slow-mo video of underwater strikes on a prop bait. Now there's a certain frequency that a prop bait makes that gets the attention of Florida strain bass. The lateral line system can detect frequencies of about 100 hertz, that is cycles per second, or less. Now almost certainly this is the range in which these props are spinning. The bottom line is that these baits flat out work, and with three trebles hanging down, you'd think you'd catch every fish that hits. But is this the case? Let's go to the slow-mo video and find out. Now if they slurp it from behind, yeah. But if they attack it from the side, not always. That's because the length and rigidity of the bait prevents it from entering the mouth. Natural prey fold when they get sucked in by a bass. So if you hear a slurping sound, that's a good sign, and the bass probably has the bait in its mouth. Now a blow up, even though it's exciting, says less about how well that bait is in the mouth of the fish. Prop baits are the deal here in Florida, and they are blast to fish. I'm Jimmy Liao from Fish Code Studios. If you like what you saw, please like and subscribe. Until next time.